Pike, or Aesop's Lucis, his Latin calling. Isaac Walton, author of The Complete Angler, called it the tyrant of the rivers, or the freshwater wolf, by reason of his bold, greedy, devouring disposition, which is so keen. The Angling Trust in England declared that angling would be able to continue during November lockdown to fish safely locally and the rule of two. Angling Trust made the case for fishing to the UK government based on the health and well-being benefits that angling offers, coupled with the importance of reducing pressure on other open spaces by allowing us to continue to safely enjoy the social isolation and peace that fishing brings. Now, I'm not a stressful kind of fella, but I need to get out of the house. I need that escapism and a focus. I just need to go catch a pike. I mean, you just can't beat a river. Fantastic, just for that, that peace, tranquility. It really is my sanctuary. Now, if you work in the middle of London during the day like I do, yeah, it's like chalk and cheese. Come down the river, it's just, pure solitude, you wouldn't want to be anywhere else in the world. And it's that contrast, it's a contrast that I really enjoy. It's really to put yourself at total ease. So let's get down the river, let me show you about. Watching the river, it's like life itself, moving gently along most of the days, raging on others, if it's got its own moods, much like my missus. And it'll sweep you up when you're feeling down. You see, most people, they go out and they use the river as a fleeting moment, walk with a family or a dog. Anglers will spend all day at the river, quite happy to have that time shared with nature. A whole four seasons erupting above and below the water surface, fascinating. Now to be able to catch pike, you've got to know your water. Where pike may be at different times throughout autumn and winter, are they sitting up under boats in marginal weed in the deepest middle section, under overhanging trees maybe, around obstructions? Probably a combination of all those possibilities lies the truth. Prey food such as roach will lose the weed as cover in winter and will get together safety in numbers. Pike won't be far behind. But believe me, there'll always be that rogue pike away from the rest. Well, there doesn't seem to be much going on this afternoon. I'm losing the light now, so I think maybe perhaps I'll just uh, go and drop in one last swim. A car park swim. I've just dropped this big fat juicy sardine about a foot off the bottom. And I've got to say, as it's my eyes, I think they're slightly moving. I swear, I swear it's moving. Is it? Yes, come on, yes. Come on, fish on. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I had that, I had that. Now I never know when I'm beaten. So the next day, I'm back down there. Now is there anything better than seeing your float twitch? I think not. Shut the bail on, wind down, hit it, yes, come on, fish on, come on, come on, come on. Uh, don't let the line go slack, 
thinking they've been back in the world. This is for she's Come on. <laughs> you absolute beauty. Look at that. Coin of the river. Not where the fish is. I'll get you back down, come on. Now I will never tire of seeing a good pike go back. Fantastic. So now I've got the taste of catching. I couldn't resist another couple of hours on the river on the way home the next day. And I know I've got loads of jobs at home stacking up. Well, the wife told me something. But when you're feeling lucky, it's back in the net time. Get in there. Like the cat's got the cream. <laughs>